All right, adventurers, welcome back to All Play. We're here with more of the Pokemon Soul Silver Nuzlocke. You guys remember the team. Let's go ahead and take a look before we run into. Oh my God, y'all need to be healed. I'm gonna go heal real quick. <laughs> Give me a second. All right, we're good. We're good. All right, here's the team. Let's review before we run into Victory Road. Perry, the Brave Empoleon, with Whirlpool, Aqua Jet, Surf, and Metal Claw. Dawn, the modest Hariyama. With Smelling Salt, Force Palm, Waterfall, and Vital Throw. Smell, stop, stop farting. Smells the Hardy Skun Tank. With Toxic Flamethrower, Night Slash, and Slash. Scavenger, the Modest Raticate. With Fly, Crunch, Super Fang, and Mud Shot. Victoria, the Jolly Venusaur. With Strength, Growth, Sleep Powder, and Razor Leaf. And Lucky, the shiny, gentle soul rock with uh, rock slide, fire spin, cosmic power, and side wave. That's our team, ladies and gentlemen. That's who we're running in to Victory Road with. And I really hope we see the other side with everybody. All right. Here we go. It's Victory Road. All right. So there's a puzzle here. We should have an encounter soon enough. Depends on uh, when we get that catch. I'm sorry. When we, when we run around. One into a Pokemon, I should say. I'm gonna need Victoria's strength to push this boulder. I'm not gonna push it to the left. I'm not a I'm not a complete. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Anorith. Our encounter here in Victory Road is an Anorith. That's not bad, I guess. It, it could be a lot worse. It could I, I guess it could. I don't know. We're gonna metal claw it. If it survives a metal claw, we'll catch it. If not, I mean I don't have time to play with Anorith. Uh well, I guess we're going to get an Anora. I've actually never really raised a fossil. I've never really raised... I've evolved them, but I haven't I haven't uh, had a fossil on my team before. So it would have been kind of interesting. But then Anora is Bug and Rock, I believe. He's the Bug Fossil. They have Dragonair here in Victory Road, ladies and gentlemen. That makes me sad. We could have had a Dragonite on the team. We could have added Dragonite on the team. In case you guys are wondering why I sound a little different, if I do sound different to you, I, I sound different to me. It's because I'm recording this at what, nine in the morning? That's that's weird. That's weird. There's a wild skun tank. All right, I'm recording this at nine in the morning. I generally, generally don't do morning recordings, but like I said, I want to try and get this out. I want to try to get this, get get through this, because we're actually near a very fun part of the game. I picked up an icy rock. If you remember, there was a smooth rock that I found much earlier in the game. Smooth rock increases the duration of the move sandstorm. It makes the sandstorm sandstorm last longer. Icy rock does the very same thing for hail. Let's see. Do we? How how how, how would one navigate? How would one navigate Victory Road? This is kind of maze-like. I'm about to start using up my repels. I really have no use for them past this point, so I, I feel like blowing them here would be would be doing doing everybody a justice, doing everyone a justice. And it seems that we're faster than everybody. We should be 13 levels higher. So I'm I'm thinking I'm thinking uh, I'm thinking the repels. I'm thinking the repels would be uh, amazing to use. Why well, am I in the medicine cabinet? Here we go. Where am I? Oh, here we go. 57. Yeah, I think I can. I can try my best to use them all and still have some left over. Let's see, there's an item in here. Let's move this that way. Oh, it's up towards the top. Okay. Okay. Here's what we can do. Here's what we can do. Oh, wait, what? Am I really that? Uh, I should probably start wearing my glasses while I play. How about that? A deep sea tooth. That's pretty dope. You guys remember... I think we either ran into a clam pearl or a hunt tail. It's not that important which one. Um, clam pearl evolves into two different Pokemon based on what item it's holding when you trade it. If you give it a deep sea tooth, I believe it becomes clam pearl, and then if you give it a scale, it becomes Gorbis. The two are night and day to each other. One is, uh, uh, I won't say disgusting looking, but it's it's an ugly looking Pokemon. It's, dramatically ugly looking the other is a very beautiful pokemon the ugly one is blue the 
um, the pretty one is pink, and and you know they they're, they're polar opposites. It's actually pretty cool how they how they do that. They have there's a lot of diverging evolutions in in Gen three. That's when Clan Pro was uh, introduced, I believe. All right, let's see. We can move. If we move this one one space, then we can get that item on the other side over there. So let's see. We'll move this here, and then we'll very cautiously walk this way. Come on. And we got a red shard. Not entirely sure, but I think in this game, red shards are for stones. You could trade those for stones. Again, don't remember. I don't remember. It changes between games a lot. So that, that that's my excuse for why I don't remember. And I'm sticking to it. Let's see. What is this? The exit's right there. We really made our way through here in six minutes. And not even because we had the intro part of the beginning. Uh, let's see. Is there a way we can get down there from up here? Uh-oh. Might not be. Let's see. I want to go there, there. Oh, shoot. Which one is it? You know I'm going to pick the wrong one. I'm going up top first. I, I think I picked the right one. We got a miracle seed. Because you can never have too many miracle seeds, ladies and gentlemen. Repel wore off. Let's go ahead and fix that. We'll use that right about here. We'll be good to go. We'll be good to go. Here we go. Look at that. I picked the right the right way the first time. That never happens. That never happens. There's no trainers in here. That's actually just hit me. There's no trainers there. We need Rock Smash. We'll come back for Rock Smash. With Rock Smash. Uh-oh. -uh. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. Look who it is. Hold it. Are you going to challenge the Pokemon League? Victory Road is at its end for sure. But did you notice? You didn't see any real trainers on the way, did you? Man, they were all spineless. Well, the fact that you have come this far means you're not one of them. But your journey ends here. Because right here, right now, I will crush you. All right, Silver. Silver, you're about to get the business. And not the good kind, all right? He's got six. We've got six. His first, Pachirisu, is level 36. So, of course, we're going to switch. We're going to switch good old Perry the F out of there. Pachirisu, we're going to send in uh, let's send in good old Scav. Come on, Scav. It's time to shine, buddy. Super Fang. Typical Pachirisu. All right, let's match him with a Super Fang. We're faster. That's good. A Discharge. Hold it. Hold it, Scav. All right. And if we heal up, if we heal up, uh, let's see. Let's heal. Because then we won't get a crit out of nowhere. We won't get critted. Come on. Discharge. Now watch this one be a crit. Watch this one be enough to kill. Oh, okay, guess not. Never mind. I'm, I'm sorry. Here's another Super Fang. Hold the Super Fang for me. Come on. Sweet kiss. And Scav's confused. All right. It's all right. Scav, can we push through? Can you push through, Scav? Nope. That was a fool. Another discharge. We need to heal here. Come on. Come on. Oh, great. On top of everything, now Scavenger is paralyzed. I think I'll heal up and then get Scavenger out of there. I'm not going to worry about the paralysis and confusion. Confusion will wear off, but I'm not going to worry about the paralysis. Not right yet. And then we get Scavenger out of there. Um, I think maybe if we go into Victoria. Discharge. Come on. That was a crit. Okay. Okay. Let's get him out. Let's get a good old scavenger out of there. Come on. Come on. All right. All right. Super Fang, get it missed. Sucks to suck. Here you go. Hold these leaves for me. Come on. Hey. Yep. Good work, team. Proud of all of you on this day. Charizard's up. All right. He's going right to the final final. 
Come on. Come on. All right. All right. Charizard, level 40. About time we made to Charizard. Was it Charizard last time we met? I don't remember. Yes. Ooh, that crit though. Good work, Perry. One shot from the big top. Here we go. Rotom. Uh, Rotom. Who, who do we send out? Smells? I believe it's Smells we send out to deal with ghosts. To deal with the gas and the ghosts and the ghouls. You stop that. You stop farting. Smells, it's not right. Here's a nice slash. Hold this nice slash for us. Come on. Come on. Mm -hmm. Good work, Smells. Now, if only you could stop farting. If only you could stop farting. Armaldo. 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 He's bugging and rock. If you guys remember, very earlier in this episode, our encounter was Anorith. Anorith evolves into this Pokemon. It evolves into Armaldo. Look, they look very similar. Except one stands upright and the other scutters on the ground. Come on. Metal Claw. It shouldn't be too good. It shouldn't be too strong. There we go. So it's not what I was expecting. Oh, protect. Ooh, that protect. Ooh, y'all got me with the protect. I can't stand it. Mm-hmm. Metal Claw again. Come on. Mm. One more. Oh. Y'all in the protect. Y'all in the protect are running me thin. Here we go. Oh, withdrawn. Uh-oh. To dust stocks. Bug and poison. I think we'll be all right. Come on. Dang. That poison is saving it. That makes me sad. Here's a waterfall. Go ahead, Dawn. Come on. Yeah. That's a lot. Whirlwind. Not going to work here, buddy. You better try that on some other wild Pokemon. Here we go. Come on. Perfect. Good work, Dawn. Good work, Dawn. You're handling two for the price of one. Giraffe Rig. Giraffe Rig is normal and psychic. That's the weirdest combination. It smells. Ugh, he's going to fart. Normal and Psychic is the weirdest combination of it. You would think it'd be something like Fire and Water, Electric and Ground. No. Normal and Psychic is a very weird combination. And I'm, I'm calling that. I'm making that call. Come on. One shot. One shot. Good work, Smells. Proud of you. Proud of you, big dog. Yeah, yo. Our mother's coming back. I'm sending Dawn right back out. You're not escaping Dawn. I don't care. I don't even care. Here we go. Welcome back, Dawn. Hmm. I see. Seems it just wasn't just luck that's gotten you this far. You're damn right. Here's a vital throw. Ah, he switched out so that Protect could uh, reset. Protect. Protect works less often the more you use it so when he switched out it reset how many times he had used protect that's very clever there's a crit come on Don. get him with the throw yeah yo there it is hey good work i couldn't win i gave it everything i had what you possess and what i lack I'm beginning to understand what that dragon tamer said to me. Yeah, y'all. I haven't given up on becoming the greatest trainer. I'm going to find out why I can't win and become stronger. When I do, I will challenge you. I'll beat you down with all my power. <laughs> you keep at it until then. All right. Go away, Silver. No one likes you. You're, you're a bad guy. And it looks like... We made it to the end of Victory Road, ladies and gentlemen. I know we're ending this episode early, and we're, we also ended another episode, another recent one, early. That's all right. Okay, so let's talk about what's going to happen from here. I'd like to have a talk outside Victory Road. I'm sorry, outside the Indigo Plateau. 
or outside the Elite Four. Okay, so what's going to happen from here on? When we actually do continue the story, give me a second. When we actually do continue the story, we're going to be taking on the Elite Four. We'll take on each of the four members, one episode, I'm sorry, one for each episode. Uh, We'll take on the first on one day. I'll make it a Monday. The second on the next day, a Tuesday. The third on the next day, a Wednesday. And the fourth on a Thursday. I like to do the Elite Four like that. I like to space it out for each day, build up a little bit of suspense, you know, give me time to plan things out. Uh, But I have no idea what day this episode will go up on. So between now and the next Monday, uh, I'm going to be doing stuff to tie up loose ends, all right? I mentioned a lot of different projects that I was working on regarding this series, like the the radio skits, the the Voltor, what is it, Voltor flip tutorial back in the game corner in Golden Rod State. I'm going to make sure I have all of that stuff done before we actually go to the Elite Four, all right? Um, I'm also going to take a look at, look, our team's not bad. There's just a few, there's just a few weaknesses that our team has. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to look around the world for a bunch of different TMs that we're missing, a bunch of different moves that we're missing, as well as look at our Pokemon in our PC box, as well as look at that to see how I can diversify our team. We might see a few faces return, we, uh, the ones that I actually can return, like like Waste. I believe Waste didn't die. I just put Waste in the po- in the PC. Um, I'm going to look at Pokemon that might return, Pokemon that we haven't used yet, and train them up and everything. Make sure everybody is good to go. Because when we go to the Elite Four, there are certain rules. The first is once you start, the same way we fought the Kimono Girls. Once you start fighting them, you, can't, you can heal, but you can't leave to do anything else until you either beat them all or lose against one of them. Uh, so that's what we have in store. Once again, thank you guys for not only tuning in, but pushing me to play the Soul Silver Nuzlocke. <sighs> if you guys enjoyed this episode and would love to see more, then all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. That's that subscribe button. And I'll do my best, do my best to make sure you guys get to see more episodes of games like Pokemon Soul Silver, more challenges like Nuzlocke runs, as well as everything else that all play has to offer. Perry, how you feeling right now? He nodded slowly. Ladies and gentlemen, we have one of those Pokemon. I'll see you guys later with more here on all play. <laughs>